1,700 metres. They're let loose. Someone exciting takes a seat at the back of the field early on. Razzle Dazzle M, the first one to hit the poly running. Hatters around them. Hot Strike secures the rails run. Angel of Justice is right there in fourth, just two and a half to three lengths off. Golden Archer improves the length on the outside. Rainbow Unicorn. Hot Money. Golden Archer just raced wide into the turn there. Rainwear towards the inside. And someone exciting is the trailer. There's about ten lengths from first to last. Razzle Dazzle M, acting as the head by a length and a half. Hatters right there in the gold silks on the outside. Hot strikes at the panels. Golden Archers creeping closer on the right hand side. Angel of Justice. Then we have Hot Money. Towards the inside, Rainway, Rainbow Unicorn, and someone exciting. Coming to the 750 metre marker, Razzle Dazzle M. Golden Archer is moving around them. Hatter between runners is only a half a length off. Hot Strike's about to get a reminder or two coming to the final 550. Angel of Justice further back. Hot Money to the inside. Razzle Dazzle M at the top of the lane. Golden Archer. Hot Strike. Hatter's tight between them. Rainwear the green caps making ground. Angel of Justice on the outside. Razzle Dazzle M towards the inside. Hot Strike. Rainbow Unicorn. Rainwear on the inside. Inside. Angel of Justice is now starting to lift on the outside. Anyone of four or five. Rainwear, Angel of Justice, Rainbow Unicorn, Angel of Justice just got up to the night. Golden Archer. Rainwear is on the inside. Rainbow Unicorn, Hot Strike, photos all the way around. But it looks like number three, Angel of Justice on a winning note. Well, they spread right across the track, and Angel of Justice, Gabriel Peterson, gets this one to lift for the victory for the Nathan Cotson team. Wins by about a long neck. Golden Archer probably runs second. Rainwear third. Rainbow Unicorn fourth. Hot Strike. Three parts of a length separating a whole host of runners. Razzle Dazzle M. Someone exciting, and then came Hatter. 300 metres to go. Angel of Justice started to burst through on the right-hand side. Three off the right. Golden Archers there down the middle of the course. Hot Strike, Rain Wear, Rainbow Unicorn. They use the entire circuit. The daughter of Master of My Fate. For Kiston Pillay Racing Syndicate, Treble N Pillay. Number three, Angel of Justice gets there. Well, we were treated to a thrilling finish. It's won here by Angel of Justice, the lightly raced to daughter of Master of My Fate. And yeah, she certainly uh, had the credentials to go on and win races, and she's done, a good, done it well here today under the urgings of Gabriel Peterson, who's notched up his second winner today. Well done to uh, Gabriel, and well done to the Kiston Pillay Racing Syndicate. Nominee there's Mr. Trevel and Pillay. Well done to you and your whole syndicate. Well deserved. You've got a lovely filly on your hands here. The gentleman that looks after uh, Angel of Justice, a thousand rand. You've won the last race uh, for a thousand rand because now for the next three months it's two thousand rand. So speak to Nathan and make sure you have another winner very soon. <laughs> well done to you, okay, my brother. Thanks, Congratulations. Thanks. Well done. Let's get Gabriel in for the second time today. Just had the three rides, I think, so two wins. And uh, I was just chatting to my colleague in the studio a moment ago. You had that injury and you've come back, and I'd love to see what the statistics are because <laughs> I, I, it's going well since you've come back. Yeah, it's almost a 20% strike rate now. Um, I got injured shortly into the new season, so I had about 28 rides and two winners. And then I got injured, and now I'm back. And in two meetings, it's three winners. So, yeah, a very exciting time. So I'm very. Uh, thankful and the, the gratitude is running through me right now to come back swinging you know so yeah uh, all thanks to mr kotzen and to everyone back at home
Let's talk about this win because I want to talk about your career a bit more in a moment. Angela Justice, lightly raced. First time you would have uh, got on her in a race. I'm sure you would have gone and worked her at home. Have you? Had you gone and worked her? Yeah, I worked on Monday. It was the first time I sort of really sat on her and got to feel her. She, she's won a gutsy race, Gabriel. Yeah, so on, on Monday her work was like sort of moderate. I was a bit... Uh, she doesn't pick it up by herself. You sort of have to make her do it. And uh, she showed that today. You really have to dig into her. And uh, once you do, she gives you her best. I'm going to put you on the spot before you go now. <laughs> Your two and a half claim. Question I'm posing to you is, you've got a, a second to talk about yourself now. Why should a trainer want to put you on their horses? Um, I usually go back to the attitude part. Uh, manners make of the man. So you show manners, you have a good attitude and a work ethic. Usually it shows the rewards. Um, from a riding perspective, I feel like I'm improving personally. Uh, I'm trying to better myself with each ride. Um, so, you know, I'm trying, I'm climbing. I'm climbing up the ladder and uh, hopefully we keep doing that. Beautifully answered. Well done. Great riding today. And I hope that you go from strength to strength. Thank you, Mr. Linfern. And then, yeah, just a big thanks to Nathan once again and to, you know, my sponsors, Fundamali. They've been, they supported me through my injury. It's, it's great to be behind the team, so Keenan, thank you. It's uh, <laughs> wonderful opportunities ahead, and uh, yeah, thanks to Hollywood Bits. Gravel. Well done, well done, Gabriel. Let's thanks. hope we talk a lot more. Well done, congratulations. Put him on the spot there, didn't I? He just, uh, and I heard you chirping, and, and it would have been a lovely answer, but it was good. He answered it well, and I think it's, uh, I think it's, it's, it's good because, uh, you know, to get chances in the industry as a trainer, as an owner, as a jockey, you need to market yourself. Yeah, 100%. You know, if they work hard, um, that was the results come through, and that's what he's been doing lately in the morning. He works hard, so he deserves to have the winners. Let's talk about, uh, we'll talk about Angel of Justice in a moment, but let's talk about Mr. Pillay and uh, the syndicate, a uh, bunch of guys and girls, and tell us a bit more about yeah, them. Yeah, a bunch of guys, um, they're very nice guys, um, I haven't had much to do with them. The horses that I have had, we've actually done very well. I love Ali, she ran four times for me, four places. We sold in the interim. Um, yeah, and then um, this filly, you know, she ran first time out fourth, then she won, then she ran fifth, and now she's won again. So we've had a good record so far. Hopefully we just keep going. I've always said to them, this filly, when she goes a bit of ground, she's going to pick up another one or two. Um, she, she seems a nice filly, nice temperament for a, a master of my fate. And just well done to them, and thanks for the support, and to the breeders, and then to all the guys back at home, and just keeping the stable going for me. Thanks. Nate, she's yeah, done well. She's lightly raised. She's progressive, and uh, no doubt uh, you haven't got to the bottom of her yet. And I think they're going to have some fun. And a vast fontaine bred horse, you can never go wrong with their horses. 100%. You know, they're always well bred, and, and, and I think she'll also even go a bit further, too. Well, to you and the whole team and the family, lovely to have uh, Stormy, yeah, Storm, yeah. of course, well, with you time, and yeah. uh, leading in your winner. Absolutely wonderful, and we wish you all the best. Thanks very much. Appreciate it. Thank lovely, you. Nate. Congratulations. Also back from Cape Town. Sale was good, Nathan. Had a good sale. Lovely. Two horses he acquired in the Cape Sales. Well done to you, Nathan Cotson. Congratulations. And to the whole Kiston Pillay Racing Syndicate uh, and, and the whole Pillay family and all your partners and friends and loved ones, a huge congratulations. You're going to have fun with this filly. She won a gutsy race. When she got into that scrap, she didn't lie down. She just fought for victory. The numbers, 3, 10, 9 and 6. We'll be back just now with the wrap of today's racing.